first problem we had was 1117 from the book changing the 4 kip loop to 5 kips. The free body diagram looks like this. And there are two loads, one of five kips at the top, another one of eight kips at the joint, and it is labeled as such, A, B, C, D, and of course taking these pin supports away we replace them with forces of AY, AX, CY, CX. Distances are as follows. 8 feet, 6 feet, and 4 feet. The first step in this problem is to do statics. First, we have to ask what's being asked for. We're looking for the stress in member AB, the, uh, the deflection in member AB, and also the strain in member AB. The statics portion we can do by a variety of methods, but just using the um, the system. We can take the moments about point C, setting them all equal to zero, and <clears throat> we can eliminate, eliminate CX, CY, and AX, and we end up with AY equal to 12.25 kips. Recognizing that number AB is a strut, and its force must be in the same direction as its geometry, then force AB ends up as 20.42 kips. When you redo your exam, make sure all of this work is shown. Next we need to move on from there to find the stress in AB, which is the force over the area. Force is AB, and since it's a rectangular cross section, simply length times width. Length is, or base times height, the length is 6 inches and height is 1.75 inches. AB is 20.42 kips. Length times width ends up being 10.5 square inches. And we get a total of 1.94 5 KSI. That's the stress. The deflection is our favorite equation PL over AE. And uh, the Young's modulus is given as 10 times 10 to the 6 PSI. We already have the length here from point A to B, we can calculate this is a 6, 8, 10 triangle, so that's 10 feet, and we end up with 0 0.023 inches. Watch carefully because we have everything in inches except the length. This must be translated into inches for this to uh, come out correctly. Finally, the strain. Very simple, it's the changing length, the deflection we just calculated here, divided by the original length, and we end up with 
zero point zero one nine four percent or zero point zero one nine four. Move the decimal, please.